Hey, what's going on, everyone? My name is Chris. I'm here with Kathy. We go by Ginger Marvin, and today we have a different kind of video. Um, it's not a what's old. It's not a haul video. We're not out thrifting. We're actually making some big changes to not only our YouTube channel, but our life. That kind of sounds a little too deep. <laughs> it's not that deep, trust me. <laughs> but we do have some things that we're going to talk about in today's video. Um, and we didn't really know how to do it, really. Um, we've been talking about this stuff amongst ourselves for the past couple weeks. And recently we went to Great Wolf Lodge and we had a really good talk and just kind of like made the decision that we, we need to make some changes. And we're gonna go through those here. I know some people are gonna be maybe a little disappointed, but I hope you all can support us through these changes. Again, nothing major, but we're having an issue with time and we just don't have enough time to do all the things that we need and want to do. And so that just means we have to make some changes. And so I'm gonna turn it over to Kathy. She has a whole lit, no, I'm just kidding. She's not, we haven't really talked about how we're gonna do this. I've kind of wrote down a few notes. It feels awkward, <laughs> that's for sure. I know, it's really, we're just making a few changes with our channel, um, with our life, right? With, because there's a lot of things coming up. We have. <laughs> Our kids are... Yeah, so it's May now, yeah. so they have maybe three weeks of school left, and, you know, the end of school is always just like, oh, it's field day, yeah. and go, it's go, all go. these... Go, 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 yeah. So, yeah, this month's already going to be crazy, yeah. and then to go from that and into the summer where we have them 24-7, no mm -hmm. real dedicated time for work other than here, play an iPad for an hour while I try to yeah. list a few items and stuff like that, so... Trying to figure out how we can do the best of both worlds. Yeah. You know, having all the time with the kids, but also doing time for work. YouTube, doing reselling stuff. Because ultimately, it really does, like, we do this so that we could be home with our kids and spend time with them. And yeah. there's times we get stuck in the trap of, oh, we got to keep working, keep gotta working. Get our what's sold video up yeah. today. <laughs> yeah. And so that's, so. that brings us to our first big change, right? We're going to. We're going to be changing our YouTube schedule. We're going to be cutting back on some videos. Um, we've been talking. We're going to do three three videos a week. And our live, we're going to keep doing our live show. That doesn't really take that much time. That's pretty They're asleep at easy. Time. They're asleep. And, yeah, we're doing listings. That's a good time for us to do listings anyway. Yeah. Um, oh, we just made a sale. So that's <laughs> pretty, pretty good. $7. $7 sale. <laughs> but, yeah, we're going to be cutting back on our videos. And we're going to be changing... Kind of how we're, we've been doing. We've been feeling a little stuck. Yeah. I mean, honestly, like, like yeah. So our channel was never meant to be like a what's old every day kind of a right. channel. Just kind of, you know, that's what we started as. Mm -hmm. Some other people we watched did similar videos, and yeah. that's I guess where we got our inspiration from, and then put our own spin on it. Yeah, and then it just, which I feel like was a result of not having enough time. We got used to that. Yeah. Process of okay, this is and our we day. We did start our channel in 2020 March, so mm -hmm. we all know what happened in 2020 March. Yeah. So, you know, at first we were stuck at home right. for at least a month or two. Yeah. And no stores were really open, so it kind of made sense. And then two months of doing that, it kind of became like a habit, I guess. Yeah. And yeah. two years later, it's still the same habit. Right. And then every week when we're on our lives, we're like, oh, did you get this done? No, we didn't, <laughs> right. we didn't do anything yeah. we planned to get done ever. Like other than work, like we get our listings up mostly yeah. every week. But like, that's kind of boring. <laughs> like mm -hmm. it's boring for you, I'm sure too. We sell a lot of the similar same stuff all the time. Yeah. And I've always wanted to do like out and thrift with me or garage sale with mm -hmm. us flea market with us those kinds but which is kind of where we're tending yeah. to we're wanting to get more into kind of like days in the life of us yeah a couple few days a week so that's the first real big change and kind of the reasons why behind it and we um, did a few videos like that recently anyway. yeah like, yeah and, and you know i liked doing them because then it was yeah like so we still did our reselling work a little we got to yeah. thrift a little we got to do what sold a little so yeah we're not like taking away right. what sold and stuff it just if it doesn't work with our schedule that day it's just not in the video that day right or and we've we've actually kind of been in that trend yeah. over the past couple weeks but you know <laughs> probably because we've been talking about it but we just haven't really talked to you guys about it so that's really what this video is all about just kind of like saying what's going on and why and um you know like i do feel with the way the youtube channel has been going it's i wouldn't say burnout but um 
you know, there's there's definitely days where we're like, why why do we keep doing it this way, <laughs> right? So I definitely realize we haven't worked toward any of the goals we set. Right. So yes. We never really shared publicly, but right. We wrote down our own New Year's goals in yeah. March second, and we have done. Right. No, it's May second. May second. So five months into the year, we haven't really done anything towards our right goals. So. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're stuck. So. In, and that, and I also feel, and I said burnout, but it's, I do feel like we're less efficient than we have been in the past, Yeah. E- even though we have the same time or, you know, a little more or less, less, whatever. Yeah. But I, I'm feeling like we're not getting in, as much done in a day, right? Yeah. You feeling that too? <laughs> I definitely feel like we're not, that's just the payment. I payment for that. So, yeah, and then that with the impending chill, you know, our kids yeah, going to be here in the summer. Yeah, we going to be like anyways, yeah. and then just, <laughs> like, still try to make it work. Yeah. It's just not going to be good for anybody, really. Yeah, and we, we forced ourselves. And I think you guys will be bored of it, too. Like, it'll just yeah. seem too, like, forced and, like, I don't know. Yeah, we even forced ourselves this weekend to start working on the schoolie yeah. with the kids. And we had a little bit of fun at first, and then we got kind of frustrated because it was taking longer than we were planning. And it, it, it's just, you know, I, that's not how I want our days to go. I don't want us to be frustrated doing the things that we want to do, but we're getting frustrated because the things that we need to do or we feel that we need to do are, you know, falling behind. So, um, yeah, that's kind of why we're we're doing this and there's other big reasons like health health is another huge reason you know Kathy and I we both have fallen into unhealthy habits of just you know skipping meals which makes us eat at different hours we don't really eat at the same time and we just fall into bad habits i know i've gained a, a lot of weight <laughs> while we've been doing youtube and i haven't asked kathy <laughs> i don't really yeah. <laughs> kathy's hasn't gained any weight since then but <laughs> i don't know i don't really like check myself that yeah but, but i want to so. right and we want to go out on walks and hikes yeah. we want to take Reece this guy out some more exercise. i'll tell you he has gained so much weight since we've started youtube he truly has actually he has i know he really has. That's going to stand. And I know we used to have uh, two oh, other puppies. You want to go on more walks. <laughs> He's a boy. Yeah. We don't want his <laughs> final days to be just laying up here watching us work. <laughs> you yep. know? We want to get him out. We're going <laughs> to, we want to have a fun summer. Yeah. We live in one of, well, I'm assuming it's a Take beautiful him on state. A, I don't yeah. know. I haven't been to that many states, but <laughs> we barely ever go exploring in our own state, you know? Yeah. Like, I haven't even ever been to Pikes Peak. Like, people yeah, come here and go to Pikes Peak. We I've were just talking about that on our live. Yeah. So. I haven't been on top of Pikes Peak since, like, third grade. Yeah. I'm 35 now, <laughs> so... I've said it every year for like the past five years. We need to go. We haven't. Because, yeah. There's so many hiking yeah. trails and just cool stuff to see. And we're up here doing what's sold every day. So, <laughs> yeah, good. I mean, I still want, obviously we're still we're not quitting YouTube. No, like, no, that's no. what I feel like people are going to think. But it's not right. Like right. That right. At all, so. But honestly, the thing is, is if if we don't make a change now, that would be kind of the result. It would. It would turn into that, right? YouTube would be the thing that we would have to stop doing. We don't want to. We like doing YouTube. We enjoy it a lot. We've made tons of friends. Um, And, yeah, personally, like, YouTube was always supposed to be kind of like a creative kind of thing for me. And I don't feel like I get to do much creativity with, like, our what's olds and stuff. And yeah, like, even just putting... Right. Like we always just wanted to do, you know, we'll watch other people's videos and be like, oh, that's a cool pop up. We yeah. should do something like that. But yeah. then we, you know, it's more like, oh, we got to rush and get right. it up today or mm-hmm. it pushes the whole next week back or whatever. So, yeah, it's yeah. kind of turned this whole thing into a job, <laughs> which is why we started working right. for ourselves in the first place. Right. Yeah. Like we don't want this to be a job. We want it to be a fun way for us to make a living. And yeah, yeah, the fun is is not that fun drifting right now. away right now. <laughs> yeah. Right. Right. So, so, I don't know. I, uh, let us know what you guys think. <laughs> um, but I think I think we're ready for a change. Um, I'm ready to do some more fun, cool things with YouTube. F- for instance, another example. We haven't even done any kind of branding, right? Like, I think I, I just did a generic font for Ginger, Mar- Ginger Marvin on the top of our page. And it's been that for two years. Right. There's no, you know, I've always wanted to get... You know, 
logos done and, and branding like and stickers merch and stickers. For yeah. people that, like you guys, when you buy from us, we want right. to give you some stickers and something. Right. You know, more than just a thank you on a video. But yeah, that's that's all kinds of stuff that, you know, I, I think is my creative outlet and I haven't had that <laughs> Kathy hasn't had time to I'm find a, a hobby. Person, so. <laughs> That's the running yeah. joke. If you've been to our lives, we've been I'm trying not to gonna find a hobby no matter how much time you give me. But <laughs> yeah, I feel like your hobby is filling your time with anything and with everything. anything. <laughs> yeah. So I'll try to fill that with, well, I'll try to find stuff to fill that time with <laughs> stuff. That's not all work, you know? Yeah. But I don't know. Did you have anything else to add? I think. I don't know. I feel like we probably had more things, but I can't yeah. think of it at the moment. So. Yeah. And again, this is all stuff. We've kind of been talking about this behind the scenes over the past couple months. And, you know, as I've been editing some of our videos, I can feel there's a little bit of a difference in, you know, the way we've done things recently. And it's, you know, that fun has kind of gone away a little bit. So we've had a lot of fun doing those those other videos where we go out sourcing in the morning and and try to you know pay for our vacation or stuff like that and those are kind of the things that we're going to try to do more we'll show some stuff that's sold we're not going to be able to show everything that has sold like we have done in the past um so i don't know it's i think it's going to be a little change i mean we're not we're not oh, going into like a i didn't want to say so. so like for what sold in my head right now, as we like change to like three videos a week or something, because I haven't been doing Instagram. That was one thing I wanted to do this mm -hmm. year was more Instagram. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I've been doing less Instagram because it just feels overwhelming the amount of messages I get. And I cannot possibly. Right. I can't possibly reply yeah. to them all for stuff. But um, anyway, so if we stop doing what's old, I do kind of want to. I used to do what's old in my Instagram stories every right. day. And I kind of want to do New that again. Stories, just yeah. uh if anyone's interested in what's selling, you can check it out there. If you're mm -hmm. not, you don't have to check it out at all. Right. Um, but yeah, that way, I guess the best of both worlds. Yeah. So you can see it there. But in general, I just wanted to do better on Instagram too. Yeah. Because I feel like I've just let that go all the way. Honestly, so. <laughs> I feel the exact same way with YouTube. And if you guys don't know, Kathy basically manages the Instagram. I manage the, the YouTube. Yeah. And I haven't been able to get to comments in months, and I feel bad because, yeah. uh, you know, there's questions that go by. I, I get, I see them here and there, but, you know, I've just been in <laughs> letting things go, and um, I don't like that. <laughs> so, just trying to be real and honest with you guys. We are also making a few changes with the eBay business. We're going to be because we're not doing daily what solds from here on out. Um, we're extending our handling, right? We, oh, yeah. we did that today. Yeah, I wanted to do that just in general so it doesn't yeah. feel... Well, first off, so people don't seem like they're going to get rushed. I don't know. Sometimes I feel like stuff doesn't get delivered and people get mad about that. But mm -hmm. this way, we at least have two days to get it to them. And I still plan on shipping every day. Um, right. But, but it gives us that breathing room if we're out yeah, doing like something wanna, else. Like there's this summer, I'm going to be like... You know, I don't feel like working. Let's yeah. just go drive Let's to Breckenridge spend the day. today. Yeah. Then I don't have to think about shipping. So, yeah, yeah, I'm just going to update the handling time and hopefully it doesn't hurt my sales. It might for a yeah. little bit, but that's OK. And I know Kathy had the goal of hitting 100,000 net for this year. And, you know, we kind of were checking that out, I think, because <laughs> of, you know, the the yeah. feeling I, I keep saying burnout but not burnout <laughs> i feel like we're on the verge right like right. I, I can know. see like, us getting into a burnout if i wasn't doing youtube at all i definitely think i could have got pretty yes. dang close yeah. to that goal but to try to make them both work is just right, not right. gonna happen at least definitely not this year right um, maybe not ever but that's okay because we do you know make some income from this that kind yeah. of offsets the not listing or selling more so yeah i don't know yeah, and with that, we're probably going to pull back a little bit, not a whole lot on, like, because on our last live, we were talking, we, we got our stores up to 1,200 listings. Yeah, no, we're, we're trying to get back to, like, 1,000. Yeah. Mostly yeah. for space right now. Space, yeah, is a huge limiting factor, and... Yeah, that was another one of our 20... What is this? 2022 <laughs> yeah, What goals. year is it? Yeah. Yeah, one of our goals, and we've been wanting this for years, but we needed to have a good solid two years of reselling income. Yeah. Um, was to get a different house, a bigger house. Mm hmm And... I mean, obviously, this house is, we've mentioned we've paid this house off, and mm -hmm. it's 
it works. It's, it's small. Doable. Especially when this whole space is our whole. So yeah. our whole downstairs is maybe 1,200 square feet for four of us to live in. So yeah. just it's hard to manage. That's why there's always stuff here because we don't have any extra closets, things like that yeah. to put stuff in. So, I mean, I don't know. We were just hoping for something maybe with the basement where mm -hmm. we could have several, like a processing room, the inventory room, stuff like that. So anyways, yeah. uh, we did, you know, finally go through our process to see if we could get a house and we can um mm -hmm. but now we're just like do we want to get one now maybe <laughs> let's wait till next right. year now so it seems right now is a very pivotal point in the real estate market yeah. too yeah so we're just like man interest rates are going up stock is and my you know colorado springs houses have just went and say i think it's everywhere really yeah. but um there's some kind of like correction going gonna, on right yeah, now yeah i think yeah. they're gonna go down and I don't know. I'd rather wait maybe another year, at least until next tax time, and right. see if we can get something bigger for our money. Um, yeah. But yeah, and then this house will just be a, probably a rental or something. Yeah. So that was our one of our big goals for the yeah. year that may not happen this year, and we're fine with that. Which now. you know is not totally in our control, right? Like that's yeah. based on outside. Like of as of right now, like a house that we would probably get would be maybe just a few hundred square feet bigger right. do we really want that or do we want to just hold off a hold little off? bit longer like, there's nothing wrong with this house that we're right this is yeah a, a great house and a great neighborhood and everything right it's Plus not a, our son has a best friend across the street yeah, now yeah. and he loves his school they're both in the gifted program like those are other things that we're thinking about and then their school bus we can't take the yeah. most neighborhoods yeah. so yeah so just, it's, a it's, lot of decisions yeah. <laughs> we're having trouble making right right and it's easy to not be able to see this stuff on you. You know, we don't show this kind of back end stuff on YouTube. Um, there is a lot going on, um, but this isn't a complaint video. We're not complaining about the situation we're in. We're just taking what we have, taking the cards that we have and playing the best hand that we can with those cards. So, um, yeah, I think, I don't know, I think we've kind of talked about every big bullet point that we wanted to. <laughs> Hopefully you stick around. Yeah. <laughs> I was just checking my notes. I think I've looked over, if we've talked over everything. Um, but yeah, we, I mean, Kathy mentioned the schoolie. We want to do a lot of work on the schoolie. We want you guys to see that. And I know a lot of you are interested in that. We've never really had the ambition of having two channels. I know a lot of resellers have like a picking and flipping channel. Um, I can see the benefit in that, but we have a hard time managing our one channel. So I don't know. To me, that just seems like it would just be adding more work. And I feel like we're at a time where we need to kind of cut back a little bit more of the work. Right. So I think our audience watches yeah. more for us than yeah. necessarily. They just love what's old or something. Yeah. So I hope that you guys will. I, th I mean, it's going to be better content in general. So I right, think right. would like that because you like us. So, yeah. Yeah. I hope you like us. Yeah. <laughs> they at least like Reese. We know that. <laughs> Reese, don't run away. I don't think he can run. No. <laughs> he can still jump our fence yeah. on Please let us know what your feelings are about this change. I know, I think we mentioned it in our live that there was going to be some changes coming. And, and there was a pe couple people that hit the nail on the head as far as not being able to do daily What's Old videos. And... That just told me that it's not that hard to see it on the outside, that, you know, things um, are too much. Like, almost every one of our videos, we're like, oh, we got to go because we got to go pick up our kids, right? We have yeah. no time. So I don't think it was that big of a stretch. Um, hopefully, you guys understand, and I, I would love to have your support through this big change. It is scary. I mean, I'm not going to lie. It's, <laughs> it's two years building. It is scary. I mean, this is the kind of stuff that can kill a YouTube channel, and that's not what I want. But if we continue down the trend of how we're doing now, it's just going to die anyway. So we have to do something, right? <laughs> this video has been recorded today, May 2nd. We do have, um, I think I have like four or three or four videos that we've recorded, like the old format um, that I'm going to still put up. We do have all that footage, so I'm going to put them up. But and over the next... still recording a what sold today. Yeah, so yeah we are. It is a weekend oh, sale. We had a lot of good <laughs> sales this weekend. But it's going to take us a couple weeks to be able to... to I don't know, to get even to get used to transitioning. I would say probably toward once our kids are out of school. Yeah, I think it should be to the new schedule by then. All the videos we've already recorded should be out. Yeah. And then we should be May is going to be like the big transitioning yeah. month. 
which we don't even know because like today I just come up, start printing labels, writing on them as normal. Where yeah. if I wasn't doing that, so like. It takes a lot longer to me to write on the labels. You know, sometimes you see me go to the same box twice, yeah. five minutes apart. And obviously, if I wasn't doing what sold, I would know. Right. There's two things in box D. I'll just grab them, yeah. put them on the table, package them up. So, yeah. Yeah. So there's yeah. the change is going to happen slowly, you know, as, as slow and as smooth as we can. But we wanted you guys to be aware and uh, we wanted to be honest and open with you guys as to why things are going to be changing. Um so yeah, those videos will be coming out and then we'll be trying to get, I know it's going to take, cause we're not used to that. We're so used to doing what's like Kathy said, that that's just our, our second nature at this point. So please have a little bit of grace as we do this transition and you know, it's going to free us up to do things like, I know there's a big event coming on in August. Um, we are um, hoping to go to FlipCon. We haven't locked anything down yet, but we do have a, uh, you know, some childcare lined up and we just haven't written anything in stone <laughs> yet. So, but that's the kind of stuff that we're excited to do and want to do, go meet some friends and, you know, hang out with like-minded people and not just be stuck up in here all day <laughs> <laughs> talking about, you know, the same swimsuit that's old 10 like, times, I'm, I'm right? Honestly, like even when people do invite me, like, um, you know, we went with Kristen, a real squirrel. Yeah. And she's also invited me to another bins day um, that might even happen this month. So yeah. probably not like a video or anything, but like even when she's asking, I'm like, it's I want to go because like that's what I want to do. I yeah. want to go to the bins. I want to meet people and have reseller friends. But then I'm just like, but then I'll get behind on my work or my what sold or my yeah. whatever. So Yeah. Yeah. We don't like that feeling, <laughs> no, right? It's a bad feeling. We don't like that. So we want to be able to enjoy time with friends and that kind of stuff. So guys, I think that that's going to do, I've, I know I've said that's it. <laughs> it for, I'm going to cut those out. So you don't know that, but we've said it a few times that, uh, that's what we wanted to get off our chest and we appreciate you guys and your support through this. And we hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.